The inflection of a story matters. You had your own room in the president's house. The tone, that matters too. But how the story is told through what voice? You rode in a first class carriage with the lady who called you her own. Can answer questions long held in history's sometimes narrow view. Own a judge. Why you run away, own a judge? I wanted to give young readers a, a sense of a different perspective on slavery. Oftentimes it's about slavery, it's hard work in the field and a brutality, a physical brutality, but not emotional brutality. Ray Shepard, a longtime school book publisher turned published author, gets to the heart of the emotional need for freedom, for choice, through the story of Ona Judge, a mixed race woman enslaved to Martha Washington until a daring escape in 1796. At the period of time, she had the best job a slave could have, a personal servant to the, the, the grand lady of America. Runaway, The Daring Escape of Ona Judge is a children's book, Judge's story depicted through verse and pictures. I discovered that story and it just emotionally struck me as the story that I wanted to tell. But how to tell it? He wanted to share a different point of view from the stories he read as a child. That's where I grew up with. With people of color looking in, but their stories, in their own words, rarely represented. It's Ona's story, not Martha Washington's story. Judge spent a great deal of time in the presence of some of the most influential voices of that time. You can show these great uh, founding fathers, and she's listening, what they're preaching, liberty is what she wants. You find a woman, considered by many at the time to be treated well, living a life as the property of another person. After her escape, a reward of $10, the cost of a barrel of flour, offered for her capture and return. Because of the 1793 Fugitive Slave Act, she could never legally be free, even though she was in New Hampshire. Uh, a, a state that had outlawed slavery. But she chose that over the best job a slave could have. Warriors and diplomats who made America free. Did you think they meant you? Shepard's book has been nominated for the Jane Addams Children's Book Award, given annually to a children's book that advances the causes of peace and social equality.